Hi my friends, CA here and this week's book pick is the picture book Hungry for Science, Poems to Crunch On. Sometimes the best way for kids to understand a new concept can be through poetry or music. Schoolhouse Rock was a great thing for my kids when learning sort of uh, their multiplication. This particular story, it is a fun way for kids to get into and excited about new concepts around science. An elephant in the classroom. There's an elephant in our classroom, halfway in and halfway out. While squeezing through the doorway, he got stuck beyond a doubt. Things in motion stay in motion. Things at rest, rest. We must use force to move this beast, called out Arabesque. Gravity might help him if he falls through the floor. Gustav jumped up and down, but the ground gave no more. Pull him gently by the trunk, proposed Aidan John. His friends lined up and tried, but no one could hang on. Push him backwards, offered Claire. I'll coax him backwards too. If we all work together, he might just burst right through. They sweated and strained, though their muscles were drained and gave him a final heave. By the end of the class, that great pachyderm mass could finally happily leave. So the illustrations in the book basically incorporate children discovering science, asking questions, they're colorful. So when kids are reading the poems, they're easy poems, focusing on the topic. And then the illustrations are kids actually demonstrating or experiencing whatever it is they're trying to talk about so it can be relatable to kids on both fronts so if there are new words in there both understanding and just pronunciation there is a glossary at the back of the book as well as a little bit of a description on some of the topics covered whether it's magnets or seasons or structures so that's this week's book pick hungry for science poems to crunch on i'll include more information on the book in the description below should you be interested in adding this to your own home library as always you can find me here on wednesdays talking about books for kids perhaps books you hadn't thought about adding to your home library if you like this content like to see more content like it be sure to give it a little thumbs up if you haven't already subscribed don't forget to do so and hit the bell icon for notifications so you can find out when more videos like this are published on the channel and until next time one to beam out Ooh. Thank you.